This is Stephanie with Stephanie Cole over 50 living and I was out in the garden today and I got a couple of zucchini or I believe it's in England or in France they call them courgettes anyway they got away from me and usually what I do with these is either I make zucchini bread which I have a great savory zucchini bread recipe that I will link um, and then stuffed zucchini and my mom always made the best stuffed zucchini so I'm going to use her recipe because it's that good it's not worth even trying to change <laughs> so anyway come along with me today and let's make some stuffed zucchini we are starting off this recipe with one pound of Italian sausage you can use mild Italian sausage hot sweet you can even use country sausage if that's all you have. I've done that too. We need to brown this until it's cooked through and then we are going to let it cool. So I have our two zucchinis and I've washed them and now I am just going to cut them in half. That was not a very good job. <laughs> let's see if we can do better with the other one. So let's see if we can do a better job cutting this one in half, ginormous yellow squash. There we go. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a spoon and we are going to just take out the center And I'm going to show you a trick. The one thing that I really dislike about making this is that it takes so long in the oven and in the summertime you really don't want to have your oven going for a long time especially when it's hot out. So I'm going to show you a little trick to getting your zucchini to cook faster. So then we have our center all hauled out on this one. So we're just going to chop up our zucchini into bite-sized pieces. I'm going to put the zucchini just as it is in the microwave for 40 seconds, 50 seconds. Maybe for this big guy, I'm gonna do it for a full minute. And then I'm just gonna put it onto the cookie sheet. And that way it gives it kind of a head start on its cooking. And it actually 
helps the time immensely. So, a little tip. Into a bowl, we have the zucchini that we cut up, the one pound of Italian sausage. To that, I have two cups of diced tomatoes. We are going to add some dried basil. And I'm doing a big handful. This is from the garden. So actually I'm gonna do a little bit more. So two handfuls are probably two tablespoons of basil. Then we are going to add a pinch of salt, pinch of pepper, and I'm just gonna eyeball this, but a teaspoon to a teaspoon and a half of garlic, a half, a half a cup of panko breadcrumbs, and I have a cup of Parmesan cheese that is freshly grated. You can just buy whatever you want in the store. And then I have some panko and I have some cheese set aside for the very end. So now I'm just gonna mix this all together. This so reminds me of my childhood. This and ratatouille of all things are the two like summer meals that I remember. So now we're just going to stuff the zucchini. Now, as you can see here, they are all ready to be stuffed. Now you can use a regular spoon, but I like using the ice cream scoop because then I don't have to get my hands all gross. So we are going to add Parmesan cheese and some breadcrumbs to the top. We are going to bake this for 10 to 15 minutes without being covered and then I'm going to cover it with foil for another probably 30 to 35 minutes until your base zucchini is soft. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Until next time, bye.